Hello guys, welcome back to Yellow Nap. For today's video, we are going to show you how to use Otter AI for beginners. So if you're interested, let's start our tutorial. So if you're not aware yet, Otter AI is a great tool for you to take notes. So you could even integrate this to Zoom, Google Meet, Microsoft Teams. So we all know taking notes is a very tiresome task and this is actually needed for high stake or very important task later on now in this case otter ai can serve as kind of your assistant and basically helping you to organize things around what you need to accomplish now in this case the first thing that we want to do here is we first have to create our account now in here go to otter.ai and in their website just click on the start for free at the top right now from here we have the option to use the basic uh, plan here as well as the business trial which is free for seven days so for now let's go ahead and choose the basic here which is free get, click on get started and from here we have three options so we have the option to create an account using google and microsoft here or manually creating here by entering the email address now in this case i want to use my google account here because i want to integrate this to my google applications now let's go ahead and choose our google account here click on confirm and from here it's going to start up the sign up process now in here in the next page you'll have to answer a few things here we have the option to choose meeting recording options so which meetings do you plan or do you want author pilot to record and summarize now in this case we have meetings on my calendar with a video conferencing link or we also have the option to only meetings i manually toggle now in this case you go ahead and choose the appropriate one that you want to use and it's also going to ask you what who do you want to send meeting notes to now if you want to basically share this notes to other people you can go ahead and choose the calendar invite guest or if you want to only personally have these notes just choose just me and just hit on continue now again it's going to ask permission on your account let's go ahead and choose our account here and from here we want to basically allow it so in this case it's asking to other ones to access your google account let's go ahead and click on allow here because we have a google calendar integrated into otter now we also have the option to install Otter to Slack, but for now let's go ahead and click on Remind Me Later and we'll be redirected to the main UI of Otter. Now as you can see, there are a few things that you could do here, so let's discuss on what the things that we could do here. So at the left side here, we have our main homepage or our home here. So in our home, you have the getting started here. So it's going to give you an option to learn the basics of using Otter in a few minutes. So you could go ahead and follow the steps here just to familiarize yourself. But in this case, let's go ahead and go to all the other options. Now, we also have the My Conversations here, where in any of the conversations that you'll be having will be redirected here. And also the All Conversations section. Now, we also have the App section here wherein you'll be able to add applications like for example with Slack, Zoom, Dropbox, Google as well, and a Microsoft if you, if you want to add that. Now we also have the more option here which contains the share with me and trash as well. Now in this case at the bottom section of your screen we have the zero of 300 monthly minutes use. So since we're using a free plan for Otter AI, we only have a 300 minutes a month monthly so meaning you only have three 300 minutes monthly usage and once you reach reach the max for this one you your service itself or or yourself will not be able to use the services of other ai now in this case how do we actually collaborate with our teammates now, if you want to collaborate then you need to create a workspace so at the top left here click on work create workspace and from here you'll be able to see the option that says increase team productivity unleash the full power of other ai with teams so if you want to click on or if you want to create your teams just click on create a team here it's going to open up another tab here and from here if you want to use this feature you'll have to upgrade to other business so you have the yearly here which actually bills you 20 dollars per uh, per user monthly and i also have the monthly here which is billed 70 dollars monthly 
Now, in this case, what we need to do is go ahead and use or buy this product here. But for now, let's just use the free version. Now here, let's go back into home. And from here at the right side, you'll be able to see your calendar. Now in this case, in your calendar, you'll be able to see all of the meetings that you have since we provided access into our Google Calendar. You'll be able to see your calendar or your meetings in here or your schedule in here. Now for us to start taking notes, what we need to do is we need to access the following. So we have three sections here. We have the paste meeting URL to record, the record option, and the import. Now the paste meeting URL record here is, for example, you have a link for a Zoom meeting. You could go ahead and paste it here and author will be added to the meeting and it's going to start taking your notes. Now we also have the record option here, like for example, you have multiple people in a room and you have author open up. You could just go ahead and just record the conversation itself and you'll be able to basically start taking notes. So for example, we could go ahead and just click on record here. And from here, we need to allow the use of our microphone. And from here, it's going to start taking notes. As you can see, it's going to automatically add those words, our sentences. And from here, you can go ahead and just go hard on it. Now from here, maybe I want to set a meeting on November 31st, 2023. And from here, we could just end the note taking by clicking on the stop recording option here. Now, as you can see, it's going to give us our notes here. So in this case, go ahead and click on note here. And as you can see, it's, as you can see, you just heard my voice here. So in this case, this is our notes here. So if you go ahead and highlight some aspects on it, you'll be able to do a few things like reactions, highlights, if you want to uh, basically highlight this one so that you'll be able to go back into it. You also have the comments here. So if you want to improve on this section here, go ahead. We also have the action items. So action items are going to be task. So in this example, we want to highlight November 31st, 2023 here, or you want to highlight the meeting itself and the date. And from here, let's go ahead and add an action item. And from here, you could go ahead and choose which teammate. Now for example, let's just choose me here. And as you can see, meeting on November 31st, 2023, which I am the assigned on this specific action item. Now from here, we also have other options to change. Like for example, you copy, add image, share this to other people as well. Now in here at the top right, we also have the option to edit the conversation. Like for example, you want to click on edit here. And from here, you'll be able to edit it. Like for sometimes it's going to say you must refresh. So go ahead and just refresh your page here. Click on edit again. From here, just start editing the words and sentences here. But for now, let's go ahead and click on done at the top right. And if you want to share this, just click on share at the top right. And from here, just add their emails, channels, or names, or just copy the link here. So yeah, so this one is actually a really cool tool that you could basically start taking notes to. Also, if you already have like a video or an audio that you, that you already rec recorded, well, you could use the import option here. So you have the import of audio or video here. And basically from that uh, file, you'll be able to get your notes. So yeah, so that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to Yellow Nap, thank you for watching.